Adulting is one of the toughest phases and that is one thing that is never taught. Hi, welcome to a video where we will be discussing all about the real world work life. Uh, the good, the bad, the struggles, the ugly things, the best things about it. But I want to initiate this conversation because this is one thing that is never taught to us in our college or school or the whole educational system. And literally for the majority of our life, this is what we do. So I put up a story on Instagram asking all of you for this because I have only one set of experiences of mine, but I want to talk about everybody as much as possible so let's begin the first question is how to achieve the perfect work-life balance now uh, I am 23 right now and at this age it's it's always told to us ki ye hi umar hai kaam karne ki. this is only the time that you need to make your name earn money get settled regardless of gender which is good now that's one progress has been made but it is so toxic when that is what is fed to us we need to have a personal and social life as well and especially family takes the last seat in this whole process so what I make sure is that Sundays used to be the day where I would be able to shoot the most because there was no work that day, not any other business ka hota tha. but I have taken a leave on Sundays almost every day now because I want to spend time with the family so set that one day that works for you second question is so practical it says I got a hike but I'm not satisfied with it how to ask for more? If you are in an MNC or a, or a company where a job description does exist that you have to do so much and if you are doing more work then you can go to your employer and say ki, hey I am doing these many more things so is there a job role available for me? Instead of saying that I need more job in this job you can just tell them that I am fulfilling 2-3 different job roles at once so that they understand that you are doing different uh, like the scope of your work is more but if there isn't much scope to do more more work if there isn't much if the graph isn't there to you know go up and do more work so aapki wo company mein stagnancy aane hi wali hai but if you do that you will be in a place where you actually enjoy Third question is how to know your worth like how to know what package I deserve or what role do I deserve The thing is salary cannot always be calculated on the market research basis like for example if a chef at restaurant A is being paid 30,000 that does not mean that if you have similar qualifications you will get restaurant B 30,000 You could be working at a 5 star they usually have a higher package or you could be working at a newer restaurant who may not have the funds right now but again if you see that there's a scope for promotion and for going up the ladder then you can start there with the acceptance ki aap abhi aapka time invest kar rahe ho and agar yahan pe return mila tab yahi pe ruko ki return nahi mila tab kahin aur chale jaoge so you need to understand where you are applying and then take the market research into value how to find out what the market rate is linkedin is the god of research in here you can look for people at similar roles in other companies you can add them to your connection you can message them and ask them that would you be comfortable to give me a range of what the current price range is going ask them ki, would you be comfortable to let me know the current market rate for this job role I understand that it will be uncomfortable for you to share your remuneration but I'm applying at a new firm and I just want to understand if I'm being offered enough this sentence is golden note it down and if you ask it most people reply zarur karenge. This one is so relatable. Work from home sucks. Thoughts. Uh, for a lot of people who are new to this given uh, the lockdown, this is what you can do. You'll have to attain a lot of discipline mentally. But if it's not happening, then in your room or in your house, anywhere you go, keep separate places for working. And secondly, when it comes to work, sometimes at 11 o'clock, sometimes at 12 o'clock, if someone gives you a task, de hai na, you'll have to learn to speak up unless you really want the job. I understand that we can't say all the things to our superiors because um, if they feel ki we are we're having too much attitude they may not appreciate that which is right for them as well so sab cheez ko bolne ka ek tarika hota hai so you can politely tell them that hi uh, i have closed in for the day is it okay if i can give this assignment tomorrow to aap ko indirectly politely ghusa ke batana hai ki hey 11 to 7 is my time or uh, tell them why you can't do it right now that's a great way to tell them ki hi mera din khatam ho gaya one of my friends is actually studying for an exam so they tell the, their office ki hi I'll only be able to work till 7 because after that I have lectures bhale hi aapne lecture ko join na kara khud pad rahe ho but if you tell them that you are accountable to be in another place usually people won't bother you 
Next one is how to set the professional boundary with colleagues. Where to draw the line? One of the first rules can come in to not talk after one given point of time. So usually working hours ke baad, sari non-work baate hoti hai basically. So uh, first thing you can do is not talk to your colleagues after a certain point of time. Like if your working hours get over at seven, eight thirty nine ke baad zada baat nahi karne ki if you want to draw the line there. Especially raat ko bara baje ke aspas I don't I don't prefer talking to colleagues. Two stores I've had this experience with. एक ने रात को साढ़े ग्यारह बजे किया था दूसरे ने डे टाइम में किया था बट ऐसे टोन से बात की थी कि आई वॉज नॉट कम्फर्टेबल एंड एक ने तो रात को साढ़े ग्यारह बजे मैसेज किया था कि हाई होप यू एंजॉय द सेशन इलेवन थर्टी पी एम इज नॉट द टाइम टू टेक्सट एनी बडी लेट अलोन योर स्टूडेंट और क्लाइंट और कॉलीग तो टाइम इज नंबर वन एंड नंबर टू यू नीड टू लर्न टू से नो टू कवर फॉर पीपल लाइक अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल जिस फुट वर्क ऑन समबडी एल्स के हाई माई एक्सपाइज रिलेटिव not keeping well will you will you please do this for me one time understood twice in a month rare possibility thrice you just got to understand ki they'll always have an excuse for not doing some particular work and then they're just using you so you need to learn to say no if someone's harassing you like that ye bahut acha question hai uh, actually two question hai jo completely opposite hai but dono bahut acche hai the first one is what if i find a 9 to 5 job comfortable but the society is like do a startup to yaar jab bhi trend ka wave aata hai na people always have a strong opinion like when business was a newer thing for everybody to do pehle business was a luxury then people started learning ki oh hum bhi khud dheere dheere khud ki company bana sakte hain so once that started becoming common failures bhi badhte gaye kyun because it was a new thing a new thing ka failure rate is always more for medicine hi le lo when the first formula is developed there will be a higher failure rate than the 10th formula developed right now that people have figured out how uh, you can start a business especially jab log lockdown mein business karna seekh gaye the people feel ki sab log apna apna business start kar sakte jo sach hai but that does doesn't mean ki jobs are bad if somebody is happy with the work that they're doing if they're getting the work progress that they want to the salary incentives that they want to no buddy has the right to say anything to anybody don't give a damn to anybody who comments on your body your work how much money you make how you look anything at all just हाँ हाँ करके निकल जाने का उधर सेफ इट्स अ रिलेटिव एंड द ऑपोजिट क्वेश्चन इज आई हैव अ बिजनेस आइडिया बट आई एम स्केयर टू स्टार्ट इट एनी एडवाइस सो एवरी टाइम आई बिन आस्क कि वेन टू स्टार्ट अ यूट्यूब चैनल आई ऑलवेज हैव द सेम आंसर कि इफ यू आर ऑलरेडी परस्यूइंग समथिंग कंटिन्यू परस्यूइंग इट अंटिल योर बिजनेस का मनी इज मैचिंग योर करंट अर्निंग्स दैट इज द बेस्ट वे टू वैलिडेट दैट योर आइडिया इज गुड इनफ टू सर्वाइव बिकॉज जो आप करेंटली काम कर रहे हो उसमें जो रेमोनेशन आ रहा है उसमें तो जिंदगी कट रही है सो वाई नॉट अलाउ द बिजनेस सम टाइम टू रीच दैट लेवल एज मच एज अब इज पेइंग यू इफ यू हैव सेव्ड अप इनफ मनी एंड यू कैन सर्वाइव फॉर द नेक्स्ट टू थ्री इयर्स विदाउट अर्निंग एनी थिंग एंड इफ यू रियली पैशनेट अबाउट योर बिजनेस देन यू कैन ड्रॉप द जॉब और वॉट एवर यूर डूइंग एंड परस्यू इट इमीडिएटली ये भी काफी इंटरेस्टिंग है टिल वॉट एज शुड वी अर्न आई थिंक यू शुड अर्न टिल द एज वेर यू हैव सेव्ड अप इनफ मनी फॉर योर एल्डरली पीपल इन योर फैमिली की इवन इफ दे गेट अ डिजीज यू सेव्ड अप इनफ फॉर द ट्री treatment if you have children you've saved up for their entire life like unka education and whatever other things you would like to support them if you do if you want them to pay for their own education it's fine you don't need to save up for it but aapke loved ones jitne hain unke liye once you've saved up enough money just basically calculate how much you would need to survive and keeping inflation rate in mind because inflation is pretty existent and it's making its existence being felt loudly so 10 saal baad how much is going to cost for electricity for food for fuel I mean, if electric cars are a success, then yeah. But you need to keep all of that in mind. And once you've earned that, you can stop. And if you want to restart, you can restart also whenever. But it's just you need to feel comfortable and mentally free that you have all the funds that you would need. I'm being harassed by a person in my team on WhatsApp, and I'm too scared to share this. I can understand, especially if it's a senior person, and if you really love or need the job, it becomes extremely difficult. Anupama, बहुत सारे लोग देखते हैं Anupama में ये पूरा um, series था where her daughter-in-law was being harassed, and it was a pretty good. Like I love how the messages are passed in that show. Parents actually do have a lot of experience in this because उन्होंने इतने साल काम किया है कि इतने साल लोगों को मिल चुके होते हैं कि they understand कि उल्टे तरीके 
तरीके से भी कैसे निकालना होता है घी पता है नाउ दिस आई एम एक्सप्लेनिंग यू इफ यू रियली नीड द जॉब लाइक इफ यू डोंट माइंड स्विचिंग द जॉब इजिली देन द बेस्ट थिंग वुड बी टू टेल देम कि आई एम नॉट कम्फर्टेबल एंड इफ दे मेक लाइफ नो डिफिकल्ट फॉर यू इफ दे आर यू नो स्प्रेडिंग बैड थिंग्स अबाउट यू जस्ट बिकॉज यू डिड नॉट कोऑपरेट अगर वो ये सब फालतू के लिए करते हैं देन स्विच बट इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू स्विच एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बी वे यू आर बट स्टॉप दिस प्रॉब्लम ट्राई टू गो टू समबडी हु इज मोस्ट सीनियर दैन द पर्सन हुज हरासिंग यू एंड फाइंड सम वन होम यू रियली कनेक्ट टू एंड देन यू जस्ट शो दैम द प्रूफ की दिस इज हैपनिंग विथ मी आई अंडरस्टैंड दैट दैट पर्सन मे बी अ गुड पर्सन बट देर नॉट लिस्निंग वन आई एम सेंग दैट आई एम नॉट इंटरेस्टेड कैन यू प्लीज हेल्प मी आउट ऑफ दिस कैजुअल सेक्सिजम एट द हॉस्पिटल फीमेल डॉक्टर्स बींग कॉल्ड नर्सेज ऑल द टाइम दिस फर्स्टली इज नॉट कैजुअल एट ऑल बट द सैड ट्रूथ इज इट इज सो प्रिवलेंट एवरी वेयर दैट इट हैज बिकम कैजुअल लाइक की हाँ ये तो होने वाला है मतलब इट्स नॉर्मल एंड यू नीड टू बी प्रिपेयर फॉर इट वेन यू गो इन सो वाई आर फैमिली सेज दिस इज नॉट बिकॉज दे वॉन्ट दिस टू कंटिन्यू बट दे नो दैट दिस एग्जिस्ट एंड दे डोंट वॉन्ट देर लव वॉन्ट टू बी अफेक्टेड बाय दिस पर्सनली आई थिंक योर वर्क कैन स्पीक द मोस्ट वेन यू हैव अ गुड स्टेटस वेन यू नो योर पेशेंट्स कम ओनली फॉर यू एंड वॉट यू डू हैज दैट मच इम्पैक्ट देन यू कैन जस्ट स्पीक नंबर टू द पर्सन कॉलिंग यू नर्सिस इट फील सो सैड यार कि क्यों ऐसे लोग करते हैं वाई डोंट दे अंडरस्टैंड कि जस्ट बिकॉज एज आई सेट दे हैव अ डिफरेंट सेक्शुअल बॉडी पार्ट इट डजेंट मेक दैम द किंग और सुपीरियर एनी टिप्स फॉर पीपल डूइंग अ जॉब फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम आफ्टर ग्रेजुएशन हाउ टू मेक गुड इम्प्रेशन सो नंबर वन वुड बी अपियरेंस इवन इफ इट्स वर्क फ्रॉम होम इफ यू डू वीडियो कॉल मीटिंग्स बी एज प्रेजेंटेबल एज पॉसिबल कीप योर हेयर नीटली डन दिस इज नॉट अ फॉर्मल हेयर स्टाइल नंबर टू इज बींग ट्रूथफुल विद द टाइम लाइन्स सो इफ समन इज गिविंग यू एन असाइनमेंट से मुझे दो घंटे में करके चाहिए दो घंटे के बाद मत बोलना कि मुझे और दो घंटे चाहिए Tell them before and ki hi. I understand that you need it in two hours, but my current skill set will take me at least four hours to complete this. Would that be okay for you? And number three, always maintain professional language. What if after four years of doing something I love, I have had a burnout that I don't know how to reset myself now? If it's a temporary burnout, then you need to take a leave 100%. Even if you love your job to the T. Now I love what we do here, but sometimes I get burnt out too by doing the same thing or by stepping. Up up all the time, so I I I take a a break. I go to a place where either there's no network or I keep all my electronics away and just do something जिसका काम से दूर दूर तक लेना देना नहीं है बिकॉज द ब्रेन एंटायर बॉडी नीड्स अ ब्रेक लाइक दैट बट हाउ टू आइडेंटिफाई की टेम्पररी बर्न आउट है कि लॉन्ग टर्म बर्न आउट है स्पीक टू पीपल हु आर एट अ हायर पोस्ट इन माई केस आई लुक एट यूट्यूबर्स और कॉन्टेंट क्रिएटर्स जो टू मिलियन या टेन मिलियन सब्सक्राइबर्स पे है एंड इफ आई गेट अ चांस आई टॉक टू दम आई अंडरस्टैंड की उनकी लाइफ कैसी है देन आई थिंक Is that what I want for me? So where you are in the current position, उससे तीन चार लेवल ऊपर के किसी इंसान से बात करके देखो कि uh, उनकी लाइफ कैसी है और वो क्या करते हैं एंड सी इफ यू कैन फाइंड अ कनेक्शन बिटवीन द टू इफ यू फाइंड अ कनेक्शन ग्रेट इट्स अ टेम्पररी बर्न आउट इफ नॉट यू माइट नॉट वॉन्ट कंटिन्यू ऑन दिस पाथ एंड ट्राई समथिंग एल्स Oh my god this married from one month and the balance of household and work is quite a thing i'm speechless about this because i know how true this is one of the best things that you could do to handle this eventually is if your earnings can support it you can hire people from your salary taki aap ghar pe kisi ko force nahi kar rahe ho ki you pay for the cook or you pay for this laundry person or you pay for the maid who will come and help me even more aapke salary se bhar rahe ho to ideally nobody should be stopping you and you can just outsource your work basically like if you're expected to cook everyone's lunch before you go or if you're expected to cook dinner after you come back you can just hire a cook eventually and uh, let them handle some things for you but it was such a good talk i think ye video bahut bada ho gaya hoga but this is one conversation that i wanted to start and um let's make episode 2 all about family life now it can be again all the good the bad the dirty the ugly the best about family it could be about some toxic situations it could be about some situations that really made you proud and happy uh, could be somebody else's achievement or how your achievement helped somebody sub sub everything that goes on in a family in reality let's discuss that so that abhi dekho the person who is married uh, they ask this question so people who are not married they are getting a 
ट्रू पिक्चर की यार अच्छा होता है शादी के बाद भी ऐसा होता है तो जब सबके क्वेश्चन आ जाते ना यार तो सबको बड़ी हेल्प और बहुत ही अच्छी कॉन्वर्जेशन बन जाती है सो लेट मी नो योर एक्सपीरियंस अबाउट वॉट हैपन इन द फैमिली इन द इन द कॉमेंट्स डाउन बिलो आई ऑल्सो पोस्ट अ स्टोरी ऑन इंस्टाग्राम अगेन एंड वी विल मेक एपिसोड टू रियली सून बट यार मुझे ये भी बताना कि आपको ये पसंद आ रहा है कि नहीं ये पूरी कॉन्वर्जेशन एंड इफ यू एंजॉय वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो गिव अ थम्स अप एंड सब्सक्राइब टू आर चैनल इफ यू डिड नॉट एंजॉय वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो बिंदा गिव अ थम्स डाउन आई विल सी यू इन अ ब्रांड न्यू वीडियो वेरी वेरी सून अंटिल देन गुड बाय एंड हैप्पी एडल्टिंग विथ हेली